I'm Bill Michaels. The NBA season's right around the corner. Bucks fans are starting to get a little bit antsy about the season getting ready to get underway and how many wins the team will have this year. You've got Jabari Parker, Larry Sanders, Knight, Giannis. You've got a team that's got a nucleus. You've got a guy like O.J. Mayo trying to make a comeback. There's a lot of different stories here and storylines that are all going to be melded together by the new head coach, Jason Kidd. You've also got new ownership this year. John Hammond, the uh, returning general manager, he's excited. A lot of the salespeople around the team are excited. I don't want to be a bucket of cold water, but let me put the brakes on just a little bit. This is a team that won 15 games last year. Vegas picks them to win this year 24 and a half. I said 25. If they win 25 games, that's tremendous. If they won 30, that's icing on the cake. But this team is about winning and developing and learning not to lose. Because when you go through these struggles, young guys can take one of two paths. They can either accept losing or they can say this stinks and continue to get better. And you hope that Jason Kidd, his words of wisdom, and everything around this team starts to begin to reek of championships, starts to begin to reek of getting better, of, of striving for, to be the best. Not just for mediocrity, not just for the, eight, the eighth seed, but to be the best. So if you're a Bucks fan, right now, the way it sits, you've got a lot of optimism on the horizon. But hope to be a top three to five team in the NBA draft lottery, get one more key piece, and not this year, but next year you start to make a run. Don't count your chickens before they're hatched. Let's just get the team on the floor. Let's get an arena deal done. And let's make sure this team is going towards ascension and not plateau. Awesome.